If you're interested in playing basketball, come to Coach House's room on Thursday the 17th at 3 p.m. for information about tryouts on the 21st. German Club is meeting next Monday, November 14th in room 233. It will be game day and we will be playing German themed games. Make sure to go follow German Club on Instagram at Novi German Club or scan this QR code. Winter sports are starting soon, and one of those sports is bowling. This Monday and Tuesday after school are bowling tryouts at Plaza Lanes. You don't need any prior experience, so if you're interested, come and check it out. Hello Novi High School students, my name is Mr. Meinka, I'm the new superintendent, I've had the chance to meet some of you in person, um, really looking forward to getting to know more of you as uh, the year goes on. I uh, wanted to address a couple things with you, first of all I wanted to just say thank you for the amazing job that you did, I know over the course of um, the last couple weeks it's been stressful as we've had you know, a couple threats and things like that that have gone on. Um, I want to assure you that the people that um, you know have been caught with that will be held responsible and it's a very significant penalty um, you know the prosecutor in Oakland County is levying charges up to 20 years with a felony um, it's, it's considered terrorism so it's a really big deal I hope that uh, all of you will have the opportunity to collectively um, you know encourage each other if they feel that they need to talk to somebody if they feel that they're uh, concerned uh, that they know that we are here for them there's a lot of counselors and support systems in place for them I'm also really looking forward to starting. I have a superintendent student advisory team that's starting soon. I'm really looking forward to talking to a really diverse group of students about their experiences at Novi High School. I want to know a little bit more about how your day is. I want to know about you know the things that are important to you. I'm interested in uh, working with Principal Carter and uh, the entire student body on how to make sure that your voices are elevated and that we can do things that are going to help um, improve not only the high school but your experience. We want it to be an amazing experience so um, it's been such a great start for me and I appreciate your warm welcome I appreciate you saying hi to me and being kind in the hallway and um, I'm hopeful that I'll have the opportunity to meet uh, all of you real soon and uh, let's go Wildcats What's up, Novi? At the MHSAA Cross Country Finals last Saturday, for the boys, out of 252 people, Nathan Rittering placed 66th and Griffin Conway placed 79th. For the girls, out of 267 people, Anjali Kadambi placed 70th and Abigail German placed 77th. They all raced valiantly, but I decided to get their thoughts about their cross country seasons. How do you feel about your overall performance this season? I felt like it was really good. Our team and me personally, it was one of our best seasons we've had in a very long time. I was pretty consistent. Me and my teammate Nate, uh, we went back and forth and we were able to place high at big meets. So I think overall it was a lot better than it has been in the years past. I think my performance was pretty good. It was a lot better than I was expecting because I worked really hard over the summer. I didn't have a lot of expectations going in, so I think I had a pretty good season. Since it is your senior year, do you think you finished off this season on a good note? Uh, at the state meet, I was a little bit disappointed. I definitely thought I could do a little bit better. I think this was one of the best seasons that I've had, so yeah. I definitely did. We finished off our high school season out at MIS for our state competition, and I felt like it went really well. Didn't place, I guess, where I wanted at the state meet, but in other races I did. So for the most part, yeah, I was pretty happy with it. Finally, we got some thoughts from the cross-country coach, Mr. Zook. Both the boys and girls worked really, really hard this year. From beginning to the end of the year, I think they made a ton of progress. People, you know, set some big PRs. We had two Two really good groups of seniors on the boys and girls side this year. Just from a leadership standpoint, I think we're really going to miss them. We unfortunately didn't get the team to the state meet this year. You know, we got four individuals, which was awesome. But I think our, our early goal has got to be get those teams to the state meet, bring everybody to MIS next year. And that's it. It's your boy John Barron reporting on cross country for the last time. Good luck to next year's cross country teams, and have a great night, Wildcats. Our Novi Volleyball team went 21-24 and 24 this season, but lost to Northville in the district finals. Our reporter, Matia, went to go interview one of their players. 
Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with Regan Bennett, and uh, I'm going to ask her a couple of questions about volleyball. How are you doing today? I'm good. That's good, that's good. So now that your season's over, how did you feel about it? Um, I'm pretty sad about it because, like, obviously I'm not playing volleyball after high school. Um, but it was a good season, and I'm happy that I ended on that. And then, so what are you going to miss about it since it's your senior year? Um, just, like, getting to play and have fun um, just because, like, it's my second sport, so I just get to have fun with it. I'm here with the head volleyball coach, Miss Byron. Miss Byron, how are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. So I got a couple of questions for you. Uh, how do you think your season went this year? I think it was a really good season. We started off the season really rocky at the first tournament in Grand Haven and really did not know what type of team we were going to be. And then we ended up in the top 10. So I think overall it was a great season for us. So if you could do anything different, what would you done? If I could do anything differently, it would be to beat Northville. Well, I mean, that's a great answer right there. Hey, we all want to beat Northville. Great season, Wildcats. Way to play hard. Hey, Wildcats. Last Friday, the girls swim and dive team had their conference championships. Everyone did really well, and we had one relay qualify for states. We talked to the girls after the race to see how they were feeling. Personally, I felt like really nervous. There was a lot of pressure to make the state cut because we, we would be the only one scoring the state for our team. Uh, I was just really excited for our last meet as a team and to get the state cut because I was confident that we could do it. So after it, I looked up at the board and I saw I PR'd, so I knew I did well and the best I could. Um, I feel really good after. Um, I'm really happy that we were able to um, drop time and get the cut. Show us those medals. Oh. I'll have one right now. Okay. Yeah. On Thursday, the divers had their regional championships. Diver Lorelai Maisano got third place, and she qualified for states. Make sure to tell her and the 400 freestyle relay team good luck. We went around the school and asked some Wildcats if the tennis ball is green or yellow. Hey Leo, is the tennis ball green or yellow? It's got to be green. It can't be yellow, right? It's got to be green. Is the tennis ball green or yellow? It's uh, green. Is tennis ball green or yellow? Yellow. Is tennis ball green or yellow? It's green. Is tennis ball green or yellow? Is tennis what? Is tennis ball green or yellow? Oh, it's yellow. Is tennis ball green or yellow? Is what? It's yellow, right? Is tennis ball green or yellow? Yellow. Is tennis ball green or yellow? Green. Is tennis ball green or yellow? Green. All right. Vivian, is tennis ball green or yellow? Uh, it's yellow. No, 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 no it's not an interview. What is it? Is tennis ball green or yellow? Uh, yellow. Is tennis ball green or yellow? Bro, it's green, bro. I would say, like, you know, theoretically and periodically. Trump. Thanksgiving is a holiday, while Christmas is a season. Thank you so much. <laughs> when is it appropriate to start celebrating Christmas? Probably like two weeks after Thanksgiving, or start in December. Okay, thank you. When do you think it's appropriate to start celebrating Christmas? I think I've been listening to the Christmas song by Nat King Paul since the final week comes. I think that's the right time to start celebrating. <laughs> When do you think it's appropriate to start celebrating Christmas? The day after Halloween. Okay. 